Hey y'all, what's going on? I am awful. So sorry. So sorry. You guys have every right to throw rotten tomatoes at me because I have been absent. And that is not cool. And I totally get it because, you know, I made a commitment that I was going to come on here and I was going to do videos and... Like, all the adulting happened, and then there was some sickness in there, and then there was just some grumpy grumpiness with me, and then there was, like, some moments where I was like, maybe I'm just not funny anymore. Maybe I shouldn't do videos anymore. And then you all, because you guys are amazing, started going, I've really missed your videos. And then I'm like, okay, I'll come back. So here I am, I'm back, I'm back, I'm back. Okay, so if you were concerned that I hadn't been working out, let me assure you that this body is definitely on week three of phase one of her second round of 80 day obsession because that is way too many words, but I guarantee you that that's what's happening. So that means that this morning, I tried to start leg like day, but thankfully my accountability partner on my workout totally got me together um, and I did eight, I did triple A, okay? Which means arms, abs, and booty. Booty, but the other word, the one that people really shouldn't say, but I have a bad habit of saying. Sorry, Mom. Um, so let's talk about what's been going on, okay? Let's talk about phase like my round two of this, okay? Number one, let me tell you one of the things that I've been doing this week that I really noticed a difference with. drinking all my water okay so it totally got me an app that buzzes and it's like it's time to drink water it's time to drink water it's time to drink water and it's so annoying that I drink water <laughs> so I'm drinking lots of water I've been getting half my body weight in ounces and I can tell a difference like I feel good I feel good it's awesome um but let me just say like <sighs> working out when you got allergy stuff going on is not anybody's fun game no like no one wants to be like, oh, my sinuses feel like they got ran over by a semi. Let's go do some workout. But thankfully, I only missed one day um, while I was sick. So I have really been talking to my challengers about whenever we um, have things going on in our lives, we have to adjust our sales to whatever may be going on. So I am I am counting the day that I had to miss. I kept trying to make it up and my body was just saying, nope, nope, nope. Um, and so I just decided that that day is adjust my sales day. And that is okay. Like that's okay. Totally cool, okay? Pardon me, I had to burp. So, let's kind of talk about what's been going on with my biscuits, okay? Let's talk biscuits for a minute. And if you are down with the Amanda lingo, then you know that biscuits means muscles. So, I decided, I, you know, you know what round two's really been bringing with me, bringing me? Way too big for my britches time. Mm -hmm. Way too big for my britches time, which means that, oh, booty day. Let's do booty day. I'm ready to do booty day, so let's do booty day with two blues. Oh, yes. Let's do booty day with two blue bands because why not? Why not? I can tell you why not. My booty biscuits are still hurting two days later. Two freaking days later, and it still feels like that Shrek, Hulk, and whatever big thing you can think of has whacked me in the booty. I mean, right there in the glutus medius thing, okay? In the meat of my rump, I have been punched. I don't know that I'll ever recover. I will, I will. I'm, I'm just being a complaining pants. Um, but you guys uh, appreciate the fact that I'm a complaining pants, right? Right? Isn't that kind of like part of this relationship that I complain and, and you guys think it's funny? I think so. I think so. So I am really excited to see what phase two or like my round two brings. 
um, because, you know, it's been just such a fun experience. And I am doing things that I never thought possible. Like the other day, I did three rounds of 10 push-ups on my freaking toes. And I don't know if you guys remember, at least here in the United States, um, we had like the presidential fitness award that you guys could get. And like, I used to be like, okay, I'm going to get that every year. I'd be like, okay, I'm going to get that. I would think really positively about it. And then my body would just be like, yeah, no, mm -mm. you, Amanda, in your pink Hanes sweatsuit, you are not winning that presidential fitness award this year. No, you're not because sit-ups and, and push-ups, and running a mile, y'all. So, to be able to do 10 push-ups in a row um, on my toes is just such an empowering feeling. It's like, yeah. So, like, I dedicate any push-ups, sit-ups, or whatever to little Amanda. Totally do. Totally do. Mm -hmm, I do. Because she did not know how strong she was on the inside. She didn't believe in herself. She tried to believe, but she fizzled out quick. And that's okay, because I got enough belief for the both of us. Guys, it is amazing to tap into your inner strength and to push yourself further than you ever thought possible. And to embrace who you are and to find yourself and to find your smile. Guys, you know what I have found in the last three months? I have gotten my smile back, and I, and I want to explain what I mean. When I had gained so much weight, all of this was very, very swollen, and my dimples had went away because there was so much weight on my face and down in here. My dimples are back. I even have one I made myself. That's a story for another time, but this one right here, I made that one all on my own. Yes, I did. Yes, I did. I have a man-made dimple. Mm -hmm, I do. We'll talk about that some other time. So, my dimples are back. My smile is back, and I am feeling pretty good. So, there's still lots of things to figure out. There's still lots of modifications happening, but I guarantee you, I am on the track that I need to be on, and I am making it happen. But now i got to log off because my app is telling me that it's time to drink more water, and that's okay. Y'all have a great day.